thousands of supporters of Egypt's military-backed government have celebrated the 2011 uprising against longtime dictatorial president Hosni Mubarak. This was the view across Tahrir Square in central Cairo late Saturday evening. Supporters of Army Chief Abdel Fattah al-Sisi held posters and Egyptian flags, pledging their allegiance to the man many want to run for president. Bands played national songs as fireworks were launched. However, the day was marred by demonstrations and killings across Egypt. The government says at least 29 people died in daytime street clashes, the majority in Cairo. Armed police cracked down heavily on anti-government protesters, firing bullets into the air and tear gas and birdshot at various crowds. Some demonstrators were supporters of the banned Muslim Brotherhood. A number of people were detained. Security was tight on Cairo's politically charged streets following the recent rise in insurgency by Islamist militant groups. A car bomb exploded near a police building in the city of Suez on Saturday. The blast was followed by a fierce gun battle between militants and government forces. Five soldiers also reportedly died after an army helicopter crashed in the mainly lawless Sinai Peninsula. The growing unrest has not dented the army general's popularity. Instead of commemorating Mubarak's overthrow, protesters in Tahrir Square gathered to display their support for the man who overthrew democratically elected Islamist President Mohamed Morsi in July last year.